The pads were on today here at AT&T Training Camp. Hi, everybody. I'm Dave Archer. When the pads go on, normally spirited play picks up, and that's what happened along the offensive and defensive lines today. I was concentrating a lot on the offensive line today because we know there's some question marks there. What's happening at left guard? What's going to go on at right tackle? We know Caleb McGarry out right now, and on the PUP list, who steps in there? Well, that was Jalen Mayfield, the youngster, stepped in. The draft pick steps in at right tackle. Look good, especially in a couple of the one-on-one -on -one situations in blocking. Now that we have the pads on, you can see the physicality. Josh Andrews' potential at left guard, or is it Drew Dahlman that steps in at left Guard. And we know Matt Hennessy taking over at center now that Alex Mack has moved on. So a lot of new components along that offensive line. Saw a lot of good work, a lot of concert work coming off the football. They've had a couple of drills out here in practice today where they're coming off together, kind of learning how to slip to that next level. We know we want to run the football with Arthur Smith's offense. And certainly we saw some signs of that physicality that he wants to show along the offensive front. Defensively, Dean Pease's defense is situational at the end of practice in the, in the red zone. Outstanding community. Communication. This is an offense that likes change strengths and formations. Guys motion across. A lot of communication on that defensive side of the football. Talked to Coach Pease right after practice, and he talked about how pleased he was in just under a week, how quickly the guys are adapting to the concepts. He's not going to fit a, a, a style of defense to player. He's fitting the players within the concepts, and they have to learn the concepts and be able to play all over the board. Really excited about the first day of pads. That's when training camp begins.